Hi guys, um, I'm here today to talk about rust. Um, it's a common problem with a lot, of, uh, a lot of us gardeners at the moment due to temperature and wet weather and we have had a bit of wet weather. Rust affects all alliums um, and alliums include onions, leeks and garlic. My garlic has got it really, really bad at the moment so I'll use that as an example to show you how you can help the problem. If you do leave rust to get out of control, it will obviously completely damage the leaves, reduce the size of your bulbs, so um, here's a few helpful hints and tips to reduce that to get you to obviously have some nice veg at the end of the season when we're harvesting garlic. So here's my garlic uh, stolen white um, and if I zoom in a bit you guys can most probably see the rust which obviously is not something that I particularly want so um, I'll start with this guy and all you need to do is remove the leaves with the rust on so chop that back it seems a little brutal but unfortunately because obviously these are the um, this is the spores which obviously will spread and this is what you want to get rid of Obviously, I'm, even if there's a little bit of rust at the top, which sometimes, obviously, this one has got a little bit, I'll just leave that on. But obviously, remove all of the stems um, just to help the problem. And um, hopefully, they'll just continue to grow with less rust. Here is some garlic that I pruned last week. Obviously, you can see, still see it's still got quite a bit of rust on it, so I may remove these leaves. Do also remember, once you have removed the leaves, you need to burn them or completely get rid of them out of your garden because it's a fungal spore, it will spread. So get rid of them and hopefully you'll have a lovely crop at the end of the year. I hope that helped you guys. Um, if you have any questions, please obviously write them down and I will be, hopefully be able to answer them for you. And um, yeah, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye. Hi guys, so if you want to obtain more information about garlic, there is a fantastic place, the Garlic Farm, uh, on the Isle of Wight. I personally still need to go and visit it. Um, I purchase all of my garlic from there because they produce quality bulbs and it's important to obviously get a good quality bulb for your, your next year's harvest. Um, I purchased a little book as well from them, which is my garlic bible with all of the information that you really need to know about it because back in the day obviously we didn't grow a huge amount or any garlic at all so it's more of a modern age growing vegetable crop um, yeah so go and check them out um, I hear it's absolutely fantastic I will be hopefully heading over there soon and maybe even do a vlog of it there and uh, post it up for you guys so you can check it out for yourselves um, yeah take care bye